to a new video. I'm Juliet, and today we're going to be talking about school. So my mom's gonna ask me some questions and I'm gonna answer them for you guys. So let's get started. So tell us a little bit about your class. Well, my class is not just a normal class. It's like an introduction class. So all the kids from completely different countries, like we have kids from Syria, Croatia, Poland, Lithuania, Vietnam, Kenya, Russia, and one another one from America. So we have a whole bunch of kids from a whole bunch of different places, and it's really cool because we get to see all the different backgrounds and how they and what they do. But also, in the process of that, we all learn Norwegian together. And then in a couple of months, we might move to our normal classes. So it's actually kind of cool to see how like we all come together and like work together to learn Norwegian. What subjects are you learning about? Well, we are not, we're only learning like two subjects. Well, I'm not like learning, I'm only learning pretty much like one subject because they're Norwegian and math. Norwegian is pretty much like you do it like almost every hour of the week, except for two hours. And those two hours are math, but their math there is so easy. So it's kind of like a refresh for me, kind of. So that's pretty much all we do. What is lunch like in recess? Well, lunch, we just eat in our classrooms. Like I have did for like, like I've done it for a few years or so. So we just eat lunch in our classrooms and then recess, or as they call it, free minutes, which is basically like, break time or whatever what it is is like how is it right okay how is it it's actually it depends but uh, there are these little bars that i always do flips on and they're really fun so i really like that and then when it's raining we'll go under me and my friends will go under an awning and we'll just like hang out and everything so but it's but i've got learned to get used to it and have fun no matter what the weather is so are you able to talk to other kids who don't know english well, actually, yes, in kind of a little bit, because I'm learning a little bit of Norwegian, so what I'll do is I'll speak like simple sentences, but the first question I'll always ask them if they try to talk to me in Norwegian is, can you speak English, which means can you speak English, and if they say no, I'll try to figure it out and everything, and then if I say I don't understand they'll try to like do motions and everything so I can pretty much most of the time understand a little bit of what they're saying so what do you say when you say I don't understand which means I I I I don't understand so do you have a lot of homework well actually yes and no so what happens is that I feel like me and my friends have like noticed that one week we'll have like homework every day and then the next week we'll have no homework. Like this week we had no homework, but last week we had homework around every day. So it's kind of like that, or if not, we'll just have like homework like once or twice a week or so, so. I mean, it's often, but it's not really often. What's it like having to walk to school? Oh my goodness. lovely no it's it's it depends like no it's not i'll tell you that walking like even like walking there and back like once is annoying but my mom who has to walk two to three times there and back i'm so sorry for her but like when it's raining i've gotten kind of used to it but like it's just the worst because like when you get there you have to take your clothes off and it's just all and like sometimes cars will come splash you by and I never wear like rain pants so like they'll come splash by and like it's it's not fun but when it's sunny it also can get kind of hot too so it's not like it's not like fun to walk 15 minutes to school what do you guys do on Fridays that's special well it's not every Friday because the past couple of weeks it's been raining but usually we'll go hike up well not all the way but we'll go take a little trail on the mountain then we'll stop somewhere and go back down or we'll go to a park or something and we'll just like play around and have fun but if it's like raining a lot 
Well, then we won't go because, like, I mean, like, we also have some other, like, work to do as well. And we already get, like, so much time outside and everything. So. What's the funniest thing that's happened at school so far? <laughs> okay. So, basically, what happened was that I don't remember if it was the first or second day of school, but it was one of those days, and these like seventh grade girls, which are which that's my grade, were come like we're trying to go over trying to find an American because their teacher said that there was gonna be this um, girl from America coming in that might come into their class in a couple months or so. So basically, they went hunting all over for me and everything, and then they found me because I was speaking English because I didn't know like. Norwegian like at all pretty much at the time so basically they found me and then they started asking a bazillion questions they were like what's your name where are you like where in America are you from like those kind of questions and then they asked one question that caught my eye the most it was do you have Target in America yes well yes I do and then they're like and I was like how did you know like, did you go to America? And only one of them has ever been to America. They were like, no. And I was like, then how do you know of Target? We've just seen it all over YouTube. And then they were like, is it true that Target has everything? And I'm like, well, close to everything. But it was actually really funny. Now, like, my mom, like, laughs at it almost every time that she hears it. But it's, it's a great story. Now on to John Hayden. What do you like about school? Um, we get to play outside three times to every day, and and I like how we get our own and I like how we get our own lunch. What are you learning about at school? The alphabet. Anything else? No, or well, something, but I don't know what they are. Are you learning any Norwegian? Yes. What words do you know so far? Um, sit up. What does that mean? Sit. What else? Um, lie. What does that mean? No. Do you know anything else? Um, I know a lot, but I don't know to all of them. Okay. Do you like going out in the woods? Nah. Why not? Because it brings down our food every day. And, and, and we normally eat inside the woods and, and never on the benches. But one time. And then our food gets wet by the trees. What about recess? Do you like having recess in the rain? Nah. Why not? Because I don't like it. And, and I Splash and put like a crazy person. So do you have to put on your rain gear? Yes, and I splash in the balls. Okay, what's in your what what's part of your rain gear? Um my rain pants, rain boots and um rain jacket. Do you like walking to school every day? No. Why not? Because because why? Because it's a little boring. <laughs> Have you made any friends? Yes, I made soup a lot. You made a lot of friends? Yes. What do you do with your friends? Um, they don't... I have four of them, but they don't play with me. So I just play alone. Why don't they play with you? I see everyone just playing with their friends, but my only friend that I... That that plays with me, sister. Do you get to see sister at recess? Yes. What do you do when you see her? I'd be like, sister! Do you run to her? Yes. Well, no, I just walk by her and then she sees me. Does she give you a hug? No. But she, but she wants me to give her a hug. Oh, okay. If she lets you. She wants to. Can you speak to your friends? Do you understand them? No, not the Norwegian ones. Can they understand you? 
No. English. Does that make you sad? Yes, but some friends know English. And I have a big kid that knows English. Does he play with you? Um, I don't see him every day. But if you do, does he play with you? He... Not sometimes. Do you have homework? Yes. How do you like homework? Um, I like the, the, the homework that has the little table on the front. <laughs> That's the homework I like. What happened to your hair at school? I cut it. Where? Did anybody see you cut it? No. What did you do with the hair? It fell on the floor. And you didn't tell anybody? No, and I pulled it down some fog. Are you supposed to cut your hair? No. Only, only unless I'm getting a haircut. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. And don't forget to go check out my mom's blog where she posts about all of our adventures here in Norway. And also, don't forget to go check out our previous videos of what we've done here in Norway and what we've done getting ready for this awesome trip. And bye guys, see you guys in our next video. Bye.